you know what I mean? This is this is Yang Yang TV. We are all around Australia telling people what we do, what the young stars do. They have many young stars in Australia. What the young stars behind it, they have football players, they have musicians, they have so much. So it'll be wash up. one of the best players. What's your name, man? Uh, my name is Emil, man. Emil. Um, I just saw on the newspaper a moment ago, and you saw one of the biggest punks that everybody, like, a black people can ever sign in Australia. Do you manage, man? Um, how do I manage? I think it's hard work, really. Hard work? Yeah, you just, you just gotta train hard and, and work hard, and I guess when you work hard, the, the, the fruits come through. So which point of the world are you going to play your so like career because your football is a like career, it's everything that you have. So which part of the world is in your football? Uh, right now I'm signed over in um, Southeast uh, Asia, in Malaysia. Um, yeah, so that's where I'm going to be playing for a couple of years now. Oh wow, so how do you feel like you look at your family and all that and go to Malaysia to play good football? Man, it's, it's a dream, but you know, you got, sometimes you got to sacrifice to get to be what you are tomorrow, you gotta sacrifice what you are today. You know what I mean? So it's, it's all right, you know, you get to it. But it's a dream, it's something I wanna do, so I gotta sacrifice as well. Wow, so how much your contract going for? <laughs> how much or how long? How much? Yeah. Well, that's confidential, man. Okay, I can't okay, really it's all right, it's all right. So how, okay, yeah. we'll get to another question. How long is your contract going for? Uh, I signed for two years, and uh, hopefully, if I do well in that two seasons, they can extend my contract while I could play a higher league from there. Wow, so what do you want? I'm set to leave in March, not uh, sure what date exactly, but um, hopefully next transfer window. Wow, thank you, thank you a lot. No worries, thank man. you so much for your All time. Right, thanks for your time. All right. Right. May God bless your trip, man. You too, man. Um, that was the, one of the best librarian players I will ever find in Australia. He signed two year season in Malaysia and he will be going into weeks time. So, librarian, watch out. I told you that we have so many players, man. So many librarian players we have in Australia. Talented people, you know. And I'll be watching. This is Yang TV. Watch out. Thank you for your time. Hello to everyone out there. This is Sifa Simon. You're watching Yang TV. When I say Yang TV, this is the best TV in Australia. But today, I have one of the best, the best football star in Australia having in studio here today. He's going to tell how he make it to the, to the best, best, best level, you know. He went to the top. So I get, I get my big star, the wonderful star, the man on it. You know what I'm talking about? Email in the studio tonight. Hey, Email, man. how you doing, man? Yeah, good man. Uh, how are you? I'm good, man. Long time, man. Yeah, I know. Hey. Yeah, I know. It's been a while. It's been a while. Watch your first game and you scored two goals in the in the game, man. That was really impressive, man. Yeah. Well, thank I know, you. I know, I know. Email, we are in the studio. Tell me, man. Tell the people what's the name. Um, my name is Neil. And um, I'm 19, uh, originally from the Guinea, Liberia, West Africa. Um, I lived most of my life in Townsville, North Queensland. Wow, wow. And um, yeah, I moved, moved to Sydney to play in the Australasian Soccer Academy. And yeah, so went overseas to trial games and I was lucky there to get picked up and sign a professional contract. That's wonderful. That's wonderful. That's really great, man. When I talk about great, that that's one of one of the great thing I ever did in Australia. To see one of the biggest, biggest star like you made it to the top and going to play high football in Australia. That's one of the biggest thing. I give you respect for that. You know that? I give you one of the biggest respect. Oh, thank you. Now, um, I saw on the newspaper. Can you tell me what's happening on this newspaper? Play. On this newspaper, I can see you. And guess what I saw the newspaper in the city? Sydney City, I was on the train when I saw the newspaper. I was like, oh my god, I can't believe it. Like, seeing you around, watching you on YouTube, and watching your football game, and seeing you on the newspaper, that's one of the great things ever, man. So tell me, how do you manage? Um, firstly, like, I'm not like, you know, the best footballers that are there. Um, I try my best. I try to you know, 
motivate myself and be at the level that I am. Um, I still have a long way to go in my footballing career, and I know that. Um, I guess for me, like I always tell myself, like how I get through things is determination is always my motivation. So if I if I want to do something and I'm determined to do it, I'll do it. So yeah, like I mean, uh, you watch the game, like you say, you watch the game. I scored two goals. You know, the team wasn't um, that they, they, they needed a goal, um, and I was determined to help the team come 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 back from a one nil win. I mean, one nil loss to win two one. So I was determined to to score them goals, and, and yeah, I, I was motivated, and I scored them two goals. So and how do you get the second? Because if I'm on the way Queensland, this is not your hometown, this is not your area, but you left the area from Queensland to here, and you make it? Tell me, man. How do you get here? And how do you make it here? Because we have a lot of good players. We have a lot of good players, but they are not making it. But you're from Queensland? Tell me, man, what's, what's, your, what's your passion? What, what's, what, what are you going through, man? Well, if you like, that kind of the answer to that question, especially I thank the Almighty, um, the man above for everything. Um, I guess personally, I believe if something is made for you, it's not gonna pass you. Um, but it's just also your determination and motivation to get that. Um, I was fortunate enough to be part of a one of the greatest, uh, the biggest academies in Australia, the Australasian Soccer Academy. Um, they provide professional training and professional um, facilities to help you train in a, prof a professional environment. So with being in that academy and training in that academy for eight or nine months, it, it prepared me to to be at, to, it prepared me to understand the level that I need to reach out to play football. So when I went overseas for trial, I was ready, I was prepared. So I guess that's what made it easier for me to get signed than most you know, like you said, most good players that are, are here in Sydney, because I know myself, there are probably players out there that are better than myself as well. We are going on a short commercial break. We'll be right back. If you want to hear an email, leave right on the station. We're going to come back ready. Short commercial break. Thank you. DRB Hickam. Which league? Um, Malaysian Premier League. Wow, so so how long are you going to be there for? Um, my contract is set for one year. One year, one year. Oh, that's nice. So, are you going to, when your contract finishes, are you going to come back to Australia to play for Australian League or are you going to leave there to try or no? What are you going to do? Um, I guess. For me personally, I, I want to I want to explore the other side of the world. Um, I've seen the A League, I've seen the league in, in Australia. Um, I'm I'm not anything special, but the league is very full. So if I need to learn more and get my I need to learn more and get better and, and go further in my career, I want to be able to play in a in a different country like in a European country where I can excel in my footballing abilities. Wow. So, Emil, thank you for your time. But what do you have to say to the, the advice you have to give to the best, like the people that come, all the young stars, the young ones, you know, what's your better advice to give to them? Um, stay in school. <laughs> nah, but like, um, I just want them to know like, it's possible if, if you put your mind to it and, and believe in a higher power every time. Um, you, you can, Never give up on your dreams. Never let anyone steal your dreams. You know, if you want something to happen, you make it happen. You know what I mean? And you don't, you, you don't make excuses for yourself. You don't make excuses for your mistakes. You take little steps to rectify them and, and to make them, uh, to make them into good things and to better you in what you do. And just good companies is, is the best way to, to to go by that. If you have good friends, you have good parents, you have you know good teachers, good coaches. Um, and you always listen to them, you, you go far. But always take initiative to rectify your mistakes. Wow, wow. Thank you. Thank you, man. Thank you for your time. No, no, may, Thank God you bless, may God bless you going in and you're coming out, man. No, no, no. Thank All you. Right. I appreciate that. That's what Emil speaking. Yeah. One of the best players.
watch up. This is Yang TV. You are watching up for all the good players in Australia. Thank you for your time and thank you. God bless you.